So for those of you who weren't around for the last episode, um, we basically got really, really close to finishing um, the game. And this is from something I was testing earlier on. Let's go back to the barracks. Uh, yeah, we got really, really close to actually finishing the game. Um, in as much that... Um, we've just got to work out the ending here on Plasma Engines. Uh, and then we are two puzzles away from finally finishing the game. Depending on how we get on tonight... I may decide to um, actually carry on doing this for the rest of the week. So we, th there may be uh, a couple of streams extra of Infinite Reactor. What's going on there? SSW380. Uh, we've only just got going tonight. So, um, yeah. What's going on, buddy? Welcome to stream. Hope you're well. Uh, anyway, let's jump in. And let's see if we can't actually finish off this plasma engines so literally like I say we are so close to finishing off here we have just got to finish off like this last bit and work out how we're going to transport it from here where it's all welded in its final position onto here so it's probably a good idea to kind of run through We run through and um, just remind ourselves where we actually got to here. That's it. So it's going to come over here. Okay, so that's welded in there. Let's go on, Death Wish. There ain't no death by goose here, buddy. Look at you with all your sparkly, spangly badges, man. So something has gone wrong with my factory. Something has gone wrong with my factory. Because when we left off last time, this was all working. And it was just a case of working out how we lift off this last piece, wasn't it? Let's check what's happening here. Let's see what's going on. Okay. <laughs> We're on the final three, buddy. The final three. It's been a slog, man, I'll tell you. It's been a long, hard slog. Right, so that's where my thing is going. Okay. So it's killing it here. All these convoluted freaking stuff going on here. Um, the pr not the previous one to this, but the one before that, I think it took me the best part of over three streams. It took me f about five and a half hours, I think I worked out in the end, to actually solve it. It's freaking intense, man. Alright, so what's happening here is that's dropping down there. So, I need to find a way which the game kind of trolled me though because I, I kind of thought I was done with it and then it throws up like a whole bonus freaking section of insanely hard puzzles at the end. So, yeah, game be trolling man. Yeah, 
Yeah, I think it's... Uh, I've, I've got it on lower latency, so I think it's literally about three or... F it should be three or four seconds at the best. So, yeah. It's all good. Have you got quality options or not, Deathwish? So I only recently found out about quality options on Twitch. Thanks for the uh, pre precise information. I appreciate that. <laughs> yeah, I only recently discovered about the uh, the quality options and how quality options work on Twitch. Apparently, um, if you are a full-blown partner, you are guaranteed to have quality options. But then, for anybody else, it depends on how many people are streaming as to whether or not there's enough resources on the site to actually provide quality options to everybody else. So... Alright, so that goes down there. That drops into there. So when this comes down to... Here. That's when I need to strike. So let me... Let me run through that again. My, my one big gripe with this game, and anybody that's been watching through will know, is that it's... I don't like the fact that you can't just, like, step into a certain point of the cycle just to, just to check or, or test something. You have to run, like, um... If I look like SS Sniper Wolf, then you become a partner in two streams. What? Okay, so I could do a counter. I could potentially do a counter here. Let me make a note of that person or that streamer. With their uh, Metal Gear Solid username. I am going to want a piston here, though. Because I'm going to want to push it off. Hold on a minute. That's the, that's the dream, isn't it? It's the dream. Sitting at home, making money, playing computer games. As I always say, as, as mad as I probably sound, I genuinely just do it for the freaking enjoyment of playing games. Uh, right, so, can I connect this up to here? I could do. So it's going to want to come over two blocks, right? higher than this. Okay, 
so. Can I do... Something like this. So they've got to come over two blocks, right? And then... If I get a conduit... See what happens here. Am I even on the same? I don't think I'm on the same level, am I? It's not gonna work because I'm a dumbass. Look, cause it's too high. What dumbass? All right, buddy. No worries. Take it easy. I'll catch you later. Golf man. Aaron wants to play with us as well, buddy. Aaron's got it. He's, he wants to play with us, so... Uh... Uh, Alright, so that would have worked. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten... Maybe I just do... why I hate like the debugging thing on this game sometimes. Oh, 
I want... kind of want it's going to need to clear that though uh, it's not going to work damn it this should be like the simple part Counters only go up to nine, don't they? Yeah. Yeah. This ain't no pretty solution. It's a good job there's no marks on prettiness. holding that up. I guess it's my crazy conduit design. Maybe this needs to be booted to the ground. Stop it from moving. Oh, 
Oh yeah. Yeah, but... Then where do I go, though? Where do I go from here? I don't think this will work properly. I think what will happen is it will just fall down. Then I try... This. Again, still not very hopeful that this is going to work. I think it's just going to fall on, on its ass. That just falls on its ass. That's fine. Maybe it. This may do just what I want it to do.
Oh, then I still need to have... Yeah, my bad. Still need to have that to take it over to here, don't I? Which will be this one, I think. that to stop it from then that then pushing it over if this works all I need to do is position the last welders and we're done I feel like I was trying to take like the massively complicated route Dropping it on there is okay. I don't see why dropping it on there wouldn't be okay. did I do wrong? This is, is this not welded? Is that what the error is? Is that not welded?
Um, That's not welded. So because of that not being welded, it throws an error. Okay, could I not do like a really lazy solution here. Welders may get in the way. Of this platform dropping down, we'll find out in a moment. doing it as like a last ditch effort here. Right before it goes in. Slice F, what's going on, buddy? Welcome along. Welcome along to the stream. Alright, so where can I... Where am I going to weld this? Good mate, cheers. I'm good. Been a tough, a tough, a bit of a tough time for me, but um, I am getting through the better of it now. Which is all that matters. sort of like for getting progressively worse for like about four or five months but um, and I say fingers crossed we're, we've turned the corner and things are getting better all right so I just want to try this That's, that's not going to work still, is it? I mean, that's fine. But...
can't put anything there because that needs to do that. Unless... Hold on. So it's going to drop there. It's going to come across here. I gave what we tapped out a long time ago, man. I kind of got to a point where I was... It's a bit sad, really, but I got sick of grinding my ass off and still not, like, making the content period kind of thing. So, yeah, I, I kind of stopped playing uh, a while back. But, yeah, it's mad to think that it is still going and they're still keeping it fresh and bringing out new updates and things. Definitely. So you can't put them there because it needs to drop down here. tapped out videos are like the most popular videos my most successful videos on YouTube but I mean when I was like literally I had the game I, I got to a point where I had the game open all day long on my tablet and I still wasn't making I just like had it open while I was working and I still wasn't making like the minimum criteria to get certain stuff and I was just like it's, it's not worth it anymore. As sad as it is. Here's me thinking like literally probably about 15 minutes of this one tonight and I'd have this one done. And 40 minutes into playing, still at it. I was thinking about what if I put a thingy in there to weld it on here.
it's just rubbish, man. It's not good. The country's being run by a load of morons. I think Wheatley would do a better job, if I'm honest. Yeah, they just don't know what they're doing, man. It's, it's crazy. Cost of living's rising. And... Yeah, cost of living is rising. And it's just, just generally, it's not good. that with that. Maybe. Yeah, Brexit's not been a good thing for the UK, that's for sure. I look at like the exchange rate to the, the dollar to the pound and it's just abysmal. It's really abysmal. I think my latest uh, Twitch subscriptions, uh, five dollars cost me like four pound. The euros just like almost one to one. I think it's like um, last time I got some euros, it was like one euro to, oh, sorry, one pound to one euro ten or something. It's just that the pound is absolutely terrible. Uh, so the goal in this game is we have to, we have various inputs and we have to put everything together to make the output, uh, which I have. Everything is working. I just need I've just got one final weld that I need to do basically, and that's what's causing me problems. Maybe I can have a... Maybe I can have an inverted conveyor. Possibly. Where would that need to go? Here, one block, and then the inverse conveyor. Let's see. can't really get trapped. So we need two 
with them. Big concerns whether or not it's just all rests on the floor, whether or not the floor gets stuck or not on this one now. Didn't get stuck. Excellent. So Once we make this... It's gonna be... I can just put it here, to be fair. I put a sensor here, connect it up to the piston, what's going to happen, I hope, is once that comes down and it lands in position, or is it going to need to be higher? The floor's gonna sit here, isn't it? Let's run through. Let's just run. I think it's gonna it's gonna go too early. And maybe surprise, something something bizarre might happen. We might get lucky. Did it work? No. It went too early. Alright, so I can't hook it up to this here. I think I decided that's that blocks it, doesn't it? Yeah, that's gonna block. Uh, well, yeah, I've kind of I've done my office. I did my office up, finished my office and everything. Uh, it's not a notice board. It's just my door to my garage, and then that's just some like cupboards behind. Um, but yeah, my face cam, so I used to point over here, this wall, but I've changed the position of it now, so I've been having a lot of issues with my camera, I, I changed my camera, I started to use my phone, I uh, bought some software and an app, um, but it just doesn't work properly, so I've revert, I've actually tonight reverted back to my, my old webcam, because I'm sick of just trying to sort it out. 
and it failing during streams, so... then leave me free to put a sensor here. Because my webcam is, my, the webcam I actually use is probably the best part of uh, 10 to 15 years old. It's a very old camera. I've had it for years. It's a good camera. But I just wanted to use my phone. Yes! I just wanted to use my phone for the, obviously the higher quality, the HD. Done it, finally. Man, that took some, What's gone on? Oh, it's pushed the welders. No. Okay, that should be easily fixable. I could instead do something like this so it does it at the side. And then to stop that from moving, I would just want that. That should do it. Uh, the, the picture, the picture is just generally sharper. I've also been looking at. Um, Playing around with some green screen stuff, potentially having a green screen setup, so I would want a better quality camera to kind of do that. trying to fix in this thing man the, the the more problems it creates I swear down
Don't want that. I have to lower it a bit more. Or maybe not. I think we're there. I think I am there. Man, this was... On the face of it, in the end, this was a lot tougher than I thought it was going to be. I thought it was just going to be a case of, like I said, 10-15 minutes, working out how to lift it onto the conveyor and sort it, but just working out, first of all, how to properly put the lid on, and then just to, then found out that I had to roll that bit in and just trying to work this bit out. It's just been like a complete uh, head mash, but um, yay, we got there. We've just got to wait for it all now to... Finish going through. And pray that there's no errors, but I don't. Th I can't see there being any errors now. Something broke. Something broke. What was that? Oh. This is this is my again. I know I say it all the time. But it's my issue with this game. I can't just go back and just like test something because it's such a big freaking factory. It takes forever. Thank you. 
Is it the engines? The engines move at a quicker speed than the rest of it. Something that happens there. Damn it, we we're so close. so close. We we'll need four more. So it's like that's being released slightly early. This is here waiting. that. Thank you. 
just need to work out where it's... Um... What I'm hoping this will do is while something is sat there, it will then stop this one from proceeding just to break it up. Because that's where my error was coming from. we can always do something with the two engines as well. Punky pop, punky pop, punky pop, punky pop, punky pop, punky pop, punky pop. Man, I can't say. <laughs> What's going on, buddy? Welcome on to stream. Hope you well. How is everything, Port Punky? Tough. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, buddy. Ah, moving house. Yeah. I know them feels. I need to watch this through till five, and then I need to go through very, very slowly to understand what is happening. Moving far. Downsizing. I upsized from the last time I moved, and I, I've never downsized actually. I can imagine 
for anybody that does downsize, it must be a complete and utter ball like. Yeah, and I thought this would just, I thought from where I left it off last week, I would be literally be like 10 minutes and done. And we are an hour and 15 in to actual playtime. So, um, yeah. There's just one thing, I can get down to like five and then something happens after the fifth one. But I'm not sure what it is. So let's just, I gotta try and watch what's going on here. different happens and I just don't know what it is. All right, so why why is that gate still open? I know why it's still open. But it shouldn't be. Yeah, no, no, no. I, I'm not I'm I'm not failing on anything, poor Ponky. What's happening is I get down to, on the fifth one, for some reason, the gate remains open. So what's happening is, as that moves away, this moves into position, but the floor isn't in place, so it screws it up. Um... My biggest frustration with it, though, is because it's happening so late in the factory. So late, we've only like four left to go. It's just an absolute ball ache to like try and fix. But yeah, I, I, for a start, I thought I got everything sorted, everything was working, and it was giving me an error, and it was because of that. I, w I hadn't welded that bit in. So, yeah, no, I, I fully already used the, the rotating of the error screen. 
but it's not it's it's not an error screen that I'm dealing with at the moment so Maybe. Maybe I can have a second input on this. I just need to prevent the hollow block. From moving and screwing everything up. I think this might work. Having that secondary input on this blocker. I believe in me as well, Paul Ponky. I think. I think I do. Two engines don't move until the white block moves, so as long as I can block the white block, block the white block, I'm alright. And what the hell happened there?
Alright, that's a new one. I d nothing, nothing different, cha nothing changed there though. I don't know why that just did that. I have no idea. But now I have to sit through this again. Unless this count... Unless it was this that screwed up, but I mean, it's been, it's fine up until that point. I just, I don't know what happened. Genuinely don't know what happened. Why that one was shifted across for some reason. than we did before. Three. Come on, three more. Just one, three more. I think I'm going to get an, a, a secondary waiting engine, though. That, I don't know how that's going to affect things. Come on, two more. That's all I want. Two more. Just two. Please. Told you it was going to screw up. You mother... So that means I gotta do something. to go man it was just one more that's harsh
Alright, so this should create two... Should create two holding spots. Uh, how wide is this? It's three wide, isn't it? Alright, so if I need... So, yeah, if, if something is... If something is already sat there and that is out, it should then block anything at one of these engines. So all I need to do is just engine block. In day, we'll leave a work or it won't. It's quite just it's as simple as that. I think it's overkill, but it'll then operate the same as the top. Which will give me two two points for blocking. As per the white block, so might be overkill and I may run into trouble with it actually I guess we'll see what happens around about now oh no that's working as I wanted it to work out this one for now.
this has to be ready before the white block comes in. I think it would be better to block it up nearer this end so it hasn't got as far to travel. far to travel which means it should always be there before the white block Waiting. Oh, so painful. different approach. If I have something there. If it's there, I'm waiting. 
That's the only time I want to block. So many times tonight have I been like, yeah, we got it, we done it, we got it, and it's like, uh, uh. what I thought would be a simple stream has turned out to be something very, very complicated. Very complicated indeed. It's just, it's that freaking complicated. I'm struggling to remember what half of it's doing. This is what I want. I want it to, like, there. It would have blocked. If, if I'd have got one already there, it would block the next one from coming. Because I'm pretty sure that's where the error was when I got down to one last time. No! 
Why does it let it go? Why does it let it go? It's so frustrating and I have <laughs> said the same thing every time. Why, why, why can't there be a function? Just to rewind time. What's going on, Dr. Keklon? How you doing today, buddy? Yeah, I'm, I, I know what you feel. I'm currently working on a map from Libby Bappa at the moment and um, called Push Too Far. And there was a tutorial room. It took me an hour and 10 minutes to solve the tutorial room alone. And I'm currently up to about two and a half hours playtime of the main chamber and still working on it. So... Um, yeah, I can totally understand about getting beat down from um, from uh, Portal Two maps. I don't stream it, but I upload daily community chamber maps um, on YouTube on oh shit so yeah that's uh, I gotta start to get an answer guys uh, subscribe to me on YouTube but like I say every day I there is a new community test chamber map uploaded whether it be uh, Portal 2 Thinking with Time Machine or Aperture Tag there is new content daily at uh, 6 p.m. GMT. But yeah, I quite um, uh, I quite like a, a difficult Portal 2 map. So a lot of maps that I play um, and get requested um, are relatively straightforward. So it's always nice to spend a substantial amount of time on a map because you get that feeling of satisfaction at the end of it when you finally work it out. But uh, what's the name of the map are you playing anyway? freaking read it for such a long time. I really should make more of an effort to go on portal maps, read it. Oh 
Oh, it's in my queue, Dr. Kecklon, actually. Seven Silhouette um, sent me a map request for that. I've been playing through the minimalism chambers, and they are tough. Seven Silhouette maps generally are require a lot more um, brain power than your average map. So, um, yeah, quite a, quite a lot of the time recently, I've actually had to refer to the walkthrough to solve them after, like, plodding along with them for quite some time. And whilst I, I don't like doing it, um, and normally I like figure it out myself, seven silhouette maps are just generally quite hard. So I do try to, if I can't see anything obvious within um, sort of 20 minutes, half an hour or so, I do tend to just get, try and get a hint from a walkthrough. But yeah, no, I, I can sympathize. They, his maps are something else. All right, so this is where it's failing. We're coming up to the point where it's failing. So why are we failing? So I have one in place. Drops down. So it's the this pushes it. Why does that push it? does this one behave differently? Is it this? Is it this? It could be. Alright, well. In that case... Let's try and rule it out, or confirm it as the issue. I feel with uh, a lot of the minimalism uh, series that um, a lot of the moves are kind of like require a bit of outside of the box thinking. Uh, it's like the last one I played was it must have been Pi. Was it Pi? The one with the um, uh, the flinging. You had like the, like this upper area with the two panels either side, and then you put the cube on the button. And then it opened up the angled panels, which you kind of had like do like some weird fling out of. Yeah, I, I, I would have never got that weird fling. To get the, to put the portal on the like the laser kind of thing. Just boggles my mind sometimes. Oh no, that's right. Um... Pi was the one with the turrets and the edge of the safety cube, wasn't it? If I remember right. Jeez, poor Ponky, how did you manage to do that? <laughs> Yeah, I kind of, I kind of cheated the, um, the like the first turret on like on its own in the middle, um, unfortunately. Willie's from Bristol. No way. 
I thought Wheatley was actually the, the, the Tooth Fairy. Or the Tooth Fairy's assistant. Alright, if this doesn't work, I have another idea. I really hope this works, though. I'm sick of running this through. Like, seriously sick of running this through. Moment of truth. I'm, um... Next game after this one, I haven't decided yet, Paul Ponky. I think that's it. I think we've done it. No! Why? Uh, I haven't, Paul Ponky, no. I don't believe I have. Um, hold on, let me... So I do pop on I'll show you. Let me show you what I'm capable of. Um, so let me bring up my library. So that's my currently playing queue. So this is like my what I've kind of like eyed up as like my two play queue. Um, so a few of these I've got actually from um, Eddie. Eddie, um, <laughs> Pom is pretty red. Doctor Kekon. Eddie sent me a list of like his puzzle games and things. So things like Cubot is from Eddie. Uh, you own that as well, by the looks of it. Um, I've got Magnetic, which I have, I'm yet to play. Steven Sausage Roll, I hear, is, is quite a good one and quite hard at the same time. So um, I've, that's been in my queue, at my um, library for, for like absolutely ages. Um, actually, it's playing currently playing. And I got like a load of other stuff as well. Ridiculously hard and ridiculously long. My sort of game. The sort of game where I can pull my hair out. I also want to... I also promised Deathwish that I would go back to... Um, Super Meat Boy, but... I don't want to play Super Meat Boy while I'm also running... Um, Tetrabot. No, I haven't got Tetrabot. Let's... Um, Tetrabot and Co. I think I've seen... I think this might have been on Eddie's list, actually. This might have been one that was on Eddie's list. I remember kind of seeing something like this. Um, but yeah, Gunpoint, I've got to play. Deathwish recommended that. That looks a good game. Um... Collisions, Cubot, 
Crips of the Necto Dancer. I say I want to I want to play Super Meat Boy, but I don't want to run that at the same time as Black Hole because Black Hole is freaking hard enough without running two different um, without running two different uh, yeah thinking of a jiggy watch and call it Ujima flippy things. <sighs> All right, so. I still don't know what went wrong there. The um, hardcore platformers are like a good smack my head against the desk kind of game. Just to break it up from the smack my head, smack the head on the desk puzzle kind of game. <laughs> oh man! But yeah, no, it's all good. It's all good. I just need to understand why this last engine. It's the very last one as well. Why this engine is pushing up and causing the issue. I say it's just really frustrating I have to do this every time. To, to look and investigate one small thing. I think if I had like a pound every time I said that tonight, I'd be like a freaking millionaire by now. I've said it so many times. Not just tonight, I've said it quite a few times throughout the entire playthrough. Throughout the nearly 50 hours of game time we've played, spent in this game. I think I know what it is. Alright, I gotta pay very close attention to what's about to happen. across and it moves across that lifts up which is right So it's not on that cycle. It's that one. this be resolved 
with a simple... time again hey flame tusk what's going on buddy um so just to kind of bring you up to speed uh this was only going to take me 10 minutes to finish off tonight we are now two hours and five minutes into finishing this this level off every time i implement something just something else goes wrong. And it is driving me potty. Not gonna lie. No! <laughs> How dare you say such things, Paul Ponky. I'm never I'm gonna start this again. Jeez. You been to the gym or something, Flame Tusk? So he needs her or Truth. I feel like I'm being just trolled so hard right now. Uh, fun fact, Flame, uh, Flame Dust, Paul Ponky. I was um, going through my YouTube channels and, and my channel and videos the other day. I think it's about, it's about a year ago since our paths first crossed when I discovered the funness that is Cursed and started playing that. I think I found it actually. I was going through my emails and I found that I, it was about this time last year that I actually gifted it to Death Wish. So, um, yeah, fun times, sad times, 
Miss Recursed. I did what? I did what? What did I do? Did I win? A winner is me. Oh, you mean at your job, don't you? Sorry, I was like thinking that like, you were talking about like you've been to the gym or something. But I know you're talking about your, your, your job, aren't you, Flavitos? How is your job going? It's good. Just this, this whole ending has just been one problem after another though it's just been so difficult yeah I used to I used to have a job like I used to have jobs working on my feet all day and it's, it's not fun please be released please be released Because uh, it's getting released too early. <sighs> what time are we on anyway? Oh, that's all right. Yeah, I I used to work. I used to work when I first got a job when I was I started working when I was twelve. And because of where I lived. Um, the like the, the the type of work in the area um, is all agricultural work, so it was like working with um, like food production. But yeah, I started working when I was twelve. So, so I know you said it was e commerce. Um, that's cool. Is it something you see yourself like staying in for a while or um or not?
Alright, let's try this. You turn men's video. Alright, so is it more like, um, is it kind of like a temporary kind of position over, it's like, kind of like the holidays and stuff? I wonder if it's, I don't know, it should be alright, it's not that far to travel, so it should always get there before the white block. Which there always will be one waiting. All of these things I am doing. I know, that's a, it's the frustrating thing. It's just one, just one thing. And I'd be home and dry. Like I say, I was like so confident that tonight would literally be like 10, 15 minutes finishing this up, then we'd move on to the next, but Instead, two hours and twenty later, we're still trying to work out how we get the last one. And
My big concern is that... Um, the engine always has to be there before the white block. At the minute, that's not a problem. At the minute. But we're getting into the, cast, the, like the territory now where it, it may be an issue. Hello, Hocus. Appreciate it, buddy. Welcome along. Um, why didn't that retract? That should have retracted. I think it's more frustrating that it's just happening on like the last one. I literally need one more complete unit just to finish the puzzle. I'm a complete unit. <laughs> You know how to brighten up a dull moment. Does it even run off that, like, upper inverted conveyor? Yeah, it does. Just have to check. I don't know, um, Flame Tusk. I honestly don't know.
So it's the next one that comes along. down. Sends the signal. Releases. Still being held by that sensor down the bottom, which I know about. See what that would do? That would hold that one at the bottom. That's it. I th I've said it so many times, but I think that's it. As long as it still operates everything as it did before, that should be it. Yep, sense being held there. second no 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 <sighs> so Could have one here. Then I could have another one here. This one would only connect to here, I believe. game. Again. I could actually, hold on. You know what, I'm not even going to mess about with it. I just want to get this freaking puzzle done. Whether it's got, it's overcomplicated, I know. But please, just work. Please! That's all I ask. That's all I ask.
come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Yes. And breathe, and breathe, and relax, and breathe. Ah, <sighs> jeez. Wow, that was, that was something. That was that was that was something. <laughs> uh, I wish, I wish, poor Ponky, I really do. Uh, all right, so let's look at the mission briefing. Hey, the first ship is nearly finished, but we haven't gotten the control systems installed yet. That shouldn't take too much time, though. It's the tour. Multiple cruisers inbound. Wait, what? Wait, wait, wait! Ah, damn! All right, so next up is the fire control system. Um, excuse me? What on... Earth. and defense systems aren't exactly ready to go, so you'll have to jury-rig them. But you're good at improvising, right? Uh, the Toads seem to have two methods of attack, missiles and fighters, so you'll have to watch out for both of those. Fortunately, we managed to install the defensive cannons. Yay! They will shoot down the nearest target when supplied with ammunition. You'll also have use of the missile tubes, which will allow you to construct and fire missiles. Missiles will automatically acquire and track targets, but have minimal maneuverability, so know what you're aiming for, okay? This isn't ideal, but, uh, hey, I'm sure you can figure it out, or else we're all dead, I guess. Um... Wait, what? A lone missile cruiser has entered our space. I I don't get it. <laughs> we have a toggle. That's the new block. Well, okay. Am I meant to like aim at the screen? Aim things at the screen? Is is that the the idea of this? All right. Well, that's one to stress over next time around. <sighs> so, 
I had toyed with the idea of carrying on Infinite Factory for the rest of the week. Um, oh, let's get back into it. Playing Tuss is like trying to. Oh, okay. Okay, okay. So, what I've got to do is look to see where I'm being fired shot from. A low has entered our space. So, like that. So, then I would... Send two. All right, so yeah, ammunition needs to go into here, and then I need to build the rockets and send the sorry the missiles and send the missiles in there. All right, well, uh, at least that makes a bit more sense. I was just looking at that and I had no idea what I was meant to be doing or where I was even meant to be starting. So um, yeah. Anyway, um, two to go. Two to go. Things are... <sighs> gone a little slow today, I'll be honest. Gone very, very slow indeed. Um, but hopefully in the next stream we can take down some toads and um, I don't know how long it'll take us, but you know, be optimistic that we can head into the final puzzle after the next stream. Like I said, I was toying with the idea that I was going to maybe stream in Fitter Factory for the rest of the week, depending on how we got on tonight. Judging by how we got on tonight, I am going to go against that advice. So Infinite Factory will return to the stream on Monday. Uh, tomorrow night we'll be picking up the hardcore platformer that is Black Hole and tearing our hair out a little bit more with that. Friday night, we will be hitting Final Fantasy New Threat Mod, followed by some golf with friends with Deathwish808 and potentially Aaron as well. So if you're interested, um, make sure you stick around for those. But as always, links are on screen. Check them out if you haven't done already. I appreciate everybody's support tonight. As always, I've been Nock. You've been awesome. See ya.